or a nerds. I have coffee. I am ready. Get back to spooky stuff. Hello, hello, hello. We had just beaten the boss, the two, um, the two taken policemen. And we got the clicker, the magic nut light switch. I have to work this out on the case board. Cool, she gave us a hint straight away. Onto the case board we go. Um, not got any profiling to do. We'll check around this place first. We do have upgrades here. Uh, fire mode, auto fire mode. Do I really want auto fire for a pistol? Especially with like. Ooh. Shoot to restore health. Uh, quicker reload speed. Yeah, that's the super shot which I've already got. Double bolts. Magnus. We'll go for a shotgun one. We'll go for reload speed. In one fluid motion, Saga cracked open the shotgun, sending the empty hulls flying over her shoulder and slammed the new shells in faster than she had imagined possible. Hi, Sun Milk. How are you doing? I have just started. I've got investigating to do. Secret hidden stream. Don't tell Omni, don't let him find out. So we have case files, what evidence have we got? We've got... The spooky... Overlap thing. So yeah, so far if you don't know what's happened in these games... Um, basically there's like some sort of otherworldly entity trying to escape um it does so by like changing things in reality but it also has a writer trapped there called alan wake who has managed to like co-opt its ability to change things so he's yeah, so like, just like Alan does in the first game where he like rewrites stuff to, to change reality. Well, the darkness entity is doing the same again. And this time, one of the characters we're playing as, which is Saga, this FBI agent, is going in to help. There. So there's the overlap. So yeah, the darkness is trying to escape. Alan is like rewriting things again to help us. So we keep finding like more than manuscript pages. And then the Federal Bureau of Control from the control game is also aware of what's happening. But they're more monitoring stuff and um they're like monitoring stuff and they're like basically doing experiments as well so at the moment i have literally just found the clicker you know the light switch thing from the first game and now we've got to make our way back to adam yeah this is her mind palace so it's based on like a, an FBI field office. But yeah, she has a mind palace and she does all of her um, like case studies and all of her profiling and there's like other bits of evidence and stuff that she finds and it all gets stored in her, here so you can review it. It's implied that her uh, her mind palace is partially supernatural as well. Hi Manu. 
Thank you for the 39 months. You're very kind. I'm sure Richard will pipe up in a second. Karamanu, hitting that 39 month mark like a champ. Thanks for the ALO and the love, Mr. Cutie. I must say, our journey together has been quite the ride. Here's to more months of fun and friendship ahead. Hello there. How are you doing, Manu? Yeah, I, I like I like playing a saga in this. Like it, it's implied that her uh, her like mind palace and her investigation skills are partially supernatural because she picks up on stuff she shouldn't really know about. Come on, Casey. No answer. David. We're all rubbish. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Hey, this is David. Leave a message. David, can you call me back, please? It's urgent. Please. Why isn't David answering? Is Logan all right? How does Scary this all time. work? Has a horror story already gotten her? Wick should know. Janice's book in the Janice's bedroom to alternate between characters and saga stories. You can choose to play whatever you choose. All right, so what I'm going to do. No worries, son of milk. I'm going to explore these previously flooded, flooded areas. I should look around, see what the water was hiding. Because there was one in here, wasn't there? And then there was one at like the trailer park. And then I'll go back to Bright Falls and switch over to Alan. Yeah, scary time, Manu. I'm doing good. Like, I'm happy I got that. Like, offer for, uh, to go to, like, an assessment interview. It's for the place that Gemma works at as well. So I messaged her and it's literally her old job that I'm applying for. <laughs> Where was it down to the water stuff? Is it this way? Because there was a bit that was flooded with like floating boat things. Forget. I've been having a look at the other Pokemon stuff as well for the the game that got announced. Because I know, like, X, Y were, like, your favourites. I think Bart mentioned they're his favourite as well. And I know very little about it other than having watched the TV series. I think they did X, Y and X, Y, Z. This way. Past the coffee bit. See, this is all like uncovered now. Or less flooded. Is this another experiment spot? Oh, another rhyme. It is. So, yeah, I've been having a look to see much, how much I recognise. Actually, got the video camera. Can't see any more dolls around here. We've got that creepy thing. Boy over there. Right, let's see what this says. Puzzle time. Devil with a prize lured the animals to to his boat, all shiny and new. Who would float and who would sink? Asked the devil with a wink. The moose went splash, the deer sailed on. Which one of them was there for? So a devil with a prize. Um, 
for the animals two by two. Two is bought all shiny and new. Um, do I have a devil? No. <gasps> yeah, I think um, even though it's all technically anime, it's only in the like the later series where they properly move over to like an anime style. any dolls up here but yeah it, it looks like it's going to be good I am um, the only thing I'm hoping is like I said before they did the the Nintendo showcase thing is that they take their time with it make sure it's properly polished and everything right devil with a prize lord the channel wants to choose about shiny the devil the link Moose went splash. Put the moose in the water. And the deer sailed on. Therefore gone. I get a feeling there should be a devil one to go here. Is that a trickster? Okay, okay. Okay then. It moved the boat. Did it? Right, pick the dolls back up. Let's see what this has for us. Was it just some ammo? No. Is that I another? Can use this charm on my bracelet. Oh, it's a bracelet charm. Mister Drippy increases damage dealt when no, because I. As cool as those things are, I don't intend on going to low health, so I won't be using it. And there's bound to be taking people around now, because there always are after uh, you do one of those. Oh, I got a, uh, I bought myself a gift earlier as well, because I was saving up to buy Helldivers 2, but I got bought it as a late Christmas, there they are, I knew they'd be here somewhere, ah, Speedy one. Oh, there's two of you. So I was saying, I got bought Helldivers 2 as a late, late Christmas present from a friend. And uh, I was actually saving up to buy it for myself. So instead, I bought myself this. So I have the new Final Fantasy to play as well. <laughs> Which I am actually, like, even though I'm not a massive Final Fantasy fan, I am actually excited to play it, because I did enjoy, like, Remake. I am getting constant messages as well, because a couple of my friends, like Dave, 
Uh, I got another friend called Ashley who's massive fans of the series. So I get constant messages from them about it. And yeah, they're really excited about it. There's a lot of people like... like they call it theory crafting. I call it tinfoil hats because they have all their own conspiracy series uh, theories about the uh, the plot of what's actually happening. Because even though it was called Remake, the events are different to what happened in the original game. So my current... Th yes. So like the, there's Final Fantasy VII, the original one. PlayStation 1 game. And they released Final Fantasy Remake. A remake doesn't cover the entirety of the original Final Fantasy VII. It's only part of it. But events are different. Stuff happens in Remake that doesn't happen in the original. Uh, there are characters who survive events that they didn't survive in original. That kind of thing. Um, so there's loads of like tinfoil hat theories about it and stuff. Uh, Dave's favourite theory is that uh, a remake isn't actually a remake it's a straight up sequel to the original Final Fantasy 7 and a certain character from Final Fantasy 7 is basically messing with things to change it how he wants it um, my current theory doggos Uh, my current theory, from what I've seen of it, is that it's like an alternate timeline. So the original game is still there. And still happened, and what we're playing through is basically happening at the same time, but in a different world. I saw you then. Where are you? We shadow monsters. Cause even at the end at the end of remake. You also see events that don't happen in your game. So my current theory is that there's like... Basically alternate worlds with alternate events. And they're kind of crossing over. There are plenty of other dumb theories as well. <gasps> yeah, I talked about Pokemon earlier, so Milk, I was saying... Um, because they've announced the new Legends game, which they've called, they call it one of those XA, I think it's called, or ZA. And I'm quite excited for it, because I never actually played XY back in the day, and I know it's Manu's favourite. So I've been looking up some stuff about it to see how much I actually know. Yeah, I've watched the series, so I know what happens, like, series-wise. Oh yeah, we can go in here now, because I've got the screwdriver to break it. Give me this. But yeah, I am quite excited for the game, because I did like Legends Arceus. It, w it was fun to play, even if the... Like the graphics and stuff were just messed up on it because of how they made it. So I am hoping they make the new one more polished, but it's going to be fun to play. <laughs> yeah, I quite like Legend. I quite I liked. It did have the one thing that I have been wanting for a Pokemon game forever, which is. To be able to just run around and catch them in the world.
but yeah I, I liked it quite a lot but i've not played i say i've not played i've not played many I'm of the pokemon games now. i've played like sword shield i've played blue and red i played let's go pikachu and i liked um i played uh shining pearl as well they're the other ones i've played yeah i did actually have a team of uh pokemon with pumped up speed purely for doing that just getting all the extra hits in and stuff straight away we've got here are these these fbc files let's have a look uh test results creating the perfect environment for each test case has been the crux of my study where well, i'm certain that setting the stage in a convincing manner will make the fiction come into existence i'm now going to use Propping in a way a set designer of a feature film would. Making the cabbing seem like the actual house of the characters depicted in the rhyme, with small personal touches and realistic items in addition to the few key items, such as the drawings, dolls and personals that has used so far. The yearly results have been promising but incomplete. I will continue with the propping in a controlled manner till it reaches a functional state. It's crucial to gain traction with this. The dimensional opening I'm attempting to manifest in this very location will be a groundbreaking achievement worthy of my genius. So this is the dude from the FBC who's been doing all these experiments with the dolls and stuff. To like alter reality or try to. So we'll have a look at that puzzle outside. Um, I'm not sure if it's a different team, actually. I think it might have been. More dolls. What have we got? We got a bear doll. Yay. Maiden. Monster. Why is there a monster doll? Why, if you're messing with reality altering stuff, would you make a monster doll? Right. Let's read the poem he left for us. A woman, eager and smart, ventured into the woods. The beast lair, the king of the forest, stole her heart. And together they now live with her cat, okay, so... Ventured into the woods. Agna puts you there. The beast lair, the king of the forest, stole her heart, and together they now live with a cat. Bear. Ah. Simples. Now, if a bear appears, I am not going to be very happy. Ooh. Yeah, I do not like the Twitch app. There are a couple of uh, third party apps. And I have tried them. I'm using, I usually use one called Chatson at the moment, but the downside is that you do get ads on it even if you're subscribed. Right, what's it changed? Coldest. Rather. There. Yeah, the uh, the whole lighting them up with a torch mechanic is still heavily a thing. But there's other stuff you can do now. Like some of them have um, basically weak points. 
there was she was a red spot of light, which is a a weakness that Alan has written into them. And if you shoot that, it's usually a one shot kill, but it's hard to hit. More shadow stuff on the floor. I better not find like an actual bear. Smashed up drawers. Like there's other stuff you can do with Alan as well. Um, <laughs> I do just not big grizzly ones that can eat you. Right, there's something in here then. We have... I'm getting quite the charm collection. Another charm. Now what's on this one? Damaged out while undetected. Ooh. Yeah, I have a... Like, my little mascot is my... My teddy bear I've had from a kid, since I was a kid. So that's what all my emotes and everything are based off, and what my little... AI buddy down there is based off as well. I oh, know I have seen one like actual bear in real life. Um, granted, it was in, in like a not a zoo, but like a safari zoo. We call them safari parks in the UK, where they they are like free to roam around and stuff. So it's like. Um, the one that I went to was at a place in Wales, and the animals that are there are basically pets that people have been keeping illegally. And they get rescued, and they go to this place that's kind of a zoo, but isn't, because they have, um, rather than, like, the small enclosures and stuff they're in, like, the entire area is open and you, like, drive through it, basically. Right, we call them safari parks in the UK. And there was a bear there, and I saw it just... Literally, there was a tree, like, probably about that size, maybe a bit smaller. And this bear just... Lifted up, leant against it, and the entire tree went over. Yeah, similar. But yeah, didn't realise how like big and strong those animals are until you see one up close. Like, bear paw doesn't look like that big. But it's like, it can easily encase your entire head in a grizzly bear paw. Easily. It's like the sheer strength behind them is crazy. <laughs> yeah, usually, because they're, um, they're all what used to be pets, you're usually okay. Like, occasionally they get agitated and stuff, but there are, uh, keepers around to like herd them away or if the worst happens tranquilize them but they keep an eye on them being agitated and stuff so they do um basically if there's if the animal's not having a good day they'll close off that part of the park so you can't get there Uh, running and biking, no. Because the animals are free roaming. Um, within their parts of the park. You can't bike or run or anything like that there. 
There's foxes as well. Um, you know the the Arctic foxes. Are they called fennec foxes? The ones with like the massive floppy ears. They have some of those there. And they have some like black furred foxes as well. But yeah, we got plenty of wild foxes in the UK. We get uh, red foxes and then there's a larger like grey furred variety called a marl fox as well, which we also get. <laughs> I am the person who always builds farms on Minecraft. Like not the um like the massive automated things like I make like small cozy farms and stuff. I think last time we played on a big server I made like a little farm with a few of every crop. Man who had like can't open this with my bare hands. Oh, I can't use the screwdriver for that one. Man who likes birds, so she had like parrots and chickens and stuff like that that she collected. But yeah, I like making farms and stuff like that. into the trailer park again because part of this was flooded so I want to see if part of it is cleared that's if I can even hit the bad guys ow yeah man who likes her bird houses there'll be a lot of them Unfortunately, his weak shots on his back, so it's really difficult for me to hit it. So I have to just fill him full of bullets. Birds. It's one of my friends from my old workplace has a. Uh, a cockatiel that has decided it likes me. See, it likes landing on my shoulder and grinding its beak, which according to Manu, it means it's happy. So I'm going to take her word for it. This bit is cleared out as well. We can have a look through here. I need bolt cutters. Still need bolt cutters. Chickens. Any bolt cutters? Another puzzle box. Need the key. Triangle logo. Another cult stash. So that's the cultist logo. Where they stash their stuff. It looks like it needs a key. So I'll need to find where they've stashed the key. You can break this with a screwdriver. <sighs> no worries, Sun Milk. She'll see you later. Computer, off we got. Yeah, what he likes to do, Manu, is ill. I always, use, I usually have my hoodie on when I go around. So he'll land on the couch while I'm sat there. He'll sort of cautiously walk across the couch, climb up my, uh, my arm, 
and then he'll sit on my shoulder and just sort of sit there and squat down. And after a few minutes, he'll usually start like grinding his beak and stuff like that. Silly spoop market game. Is it good? Is it what you expected it be? <laughs> yeah, he's a. Uh... <laughs> yeah, his his bird is very very. I don't know if tame's the right word, but it's very comfortable with people. <gasps> I'm Muffo. How are you doing? It's what you get after you've eaten a, a dodgy takeaway. An anal wake. I had one of those not too long ago. <laughs> right, where's the key? Pie in the sky. Right. He said he put the key high up somewhere. Where is it going to be? Somewhere where the flooding wouldn't get it. Unless so you're above one of these or something. I am also getting stun locked by puzzles. Right, so this bit was all basically all flooded. Trying here. Can't be opened on this side. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that one with the uh What was it? Like the the bridge and the box that you, you basically had to jump while you were doing the bridge. But I would have been stuck at that for quite a while. <laughs> Like I remember doing some of those ones in Portal 2 and my brain just not working. Right, can we get inside this one? We can't. Just shoulder the door open. In the drawers. Pistol ammo, that'll do. We're going to need some more of that. I'm sleeping on the floor with a load of booze. And we have for your manuscript page, or are you just silly drawings? Eh. Somebody's drawing comics or comic eye. Like comic ideas. Space offer a sci fi musical with an alien love triangle. Aliens meets a rear window and sunshine meets the sound of me. That sounds terrible. Look at all those paints, though. Right. Look at these keys hiding then. We got a fish cleaning station with a fish. Then all the bots. Right, I suppose I better go down the dock then. Even though bad things happen on this lake. Another doll. There's going to be another experiment down here. Got 
fishing stuff. Somebody fishing with her gone. Another experiment. There's a rhyme over here. Puzzle time. What have we got? The old fisherman had great luck. His catch at the sea was beyond belief. But the hungry guest found the in the fisherman's bountiful truck. Hmm. Right, let's see if there's any any more dolls hidden around here anywhere. It sounds like we need more dolls to be able to do that bit. Maybe. Nah. Right, so the dude said he put the key above where the flooding would reach. I know where it is. could see the top of these houses originally when the area was flooded was that a shadow person I just heard there's the huge ass creepy lake Inside here. So this just has the the cartoon drawing. Doesn't seem to be anything else in here. Not even a cool new advert to watch. Right, so there's nothing there. Let's try this one again. See, it has the indicator thingy there. One of the indicator, like the symbol there. Nah. check this so let me okay I don't need to know where you are just that you're okay reply to me I move the keys from where the flooding can't wash them away the spot might be a bit harder to reach but I'm sure you can get your hands on them just fine and that's the graphic novel idea More 
bullets. Anything? It's not on the fish. Not in the bathroom. So there's this bedroom where they obviously have like life jackets and stuff. Any key? No. I somehow knocked the TV off. Right, I have no idea where that key is. Shoot the lock. Nah. So we've got cultist symbol here. We've got one there as well. Which makes me think it'd be on the roof or something, but... Maybe. Nah. But it's definitely not any more dolls either. Especially around this bit. So what does this puzzle say again? Puzzle says The old fisherman had great luck. His catch at sea was beyond belief, but the hungry guest found relief in the fisherman's bountiful truck. So the old fisherman I made a monster moves. Wise elder. Old fisherman had great luck, his catch sea was beyond belief. And the fisherman was a bountiful truck. Crow? Doesn't look right. Uh Wolf. Nope. Long ago, guest family in the fisherman's bountiful truck. Oh. Doesn't make sense. The one that I'd literally just picked up. Child. Old man? Nah. Flotation device. No, I have made no progress down here. Oh, 
I'll have a look up the hill to the side again because the lighthouse and stuff is up there. So we'll have a look, see if there's anything we can do up there. If not, we'll head back to Bright Falls. And then we'll let Adam, Alan take over. Quick save. Towards the lighthouse. So there's nothing up here, is there? Not just the the letter we saw before. But let's head this way. Wolf! Shit, maybe jump. how the story goes. Luckily I quick save just here, so I could literally just run out and up again. I should probably heal. Right, I know the wolf is there this time, it's not gonna jump scare me. Hopefully. Mom, where are you? Where are you, wolf? Because I just got up here quicker, so they're, they're further down or something. Yeah, I can hear you. Freaky shadow monster wolves coming after you. Oh yeah, there was this one up there. Yeah, this one I've done. And I don't think I can get into the lighthouse because I don't have the key. Need the key. Right, it looks like we're going back to town then, because I can't access it. Well, I've accessed a bit, a couple of bits with the uh, the flooding going down, but 
not all of it. Looks like I still need the bolt cutters from somewhere and maybe some other way to get into places. Head back in this direction to the little town. If those two bikers this show up, they'll kick way. their ass. These two. Walking advertisements. Dude's pistol ammo. Hey there. What are you doing, you weirdo? Staring at a puddle. Flooding's gone down. Yeah, but oh, it's gone down it's everywhere. Any better. Uh, so it affected the flooding everywhere. Another stash. Another cult box. What's this one say? There are three batteries B1, B2, B3, which are combined charge of 1600 amps. B2 has 128 amps more than B3. B1 has too much, two times as much charge as B3. How many amps does B2 have? Right, uh, 1600 overall. How was it you worked this out? Uh, uh notepad. So B1, B2, B3 should have combined charge of 1600. So B1, B2, B3, 1600. B2 has 128 amps more than B3. So B2 equals... No, so that means B3 we can replace with B2 plus 128. And then B1 has two times as much charge as B3. So. Alright, I've done that wrong. So B3 is that minus 128. And B1 has two times as much charge as B3. So if B3 is B2 minus 128, then B1 is 2 B2 minus 2 56. And then we've got to level out the equation. So it comes out at 2, 3, 4, B2. Minus 3, 7, 
And it's 384 equals 600. So if we do 1600 plus 384 gives us 1984. Divide you by 4. Combination, if I've worked this out properly, should be 496. Four, nine, winner. And that's why you pay attention to maths in school. So you can complete bonus puzzles in video games. <laughs> How you doing, so milk? I have just been proving that my uh, my high school math was uh, useful. Solving x in an equation to unlock a puzzle box. Quite the show that Artsy fella put on today, eh? I loved it. I had half a mind to come <gasps> down and start dancing. Is Artie still oh, here? Oh, it looks like he's gone. Hi. So this is the save room. This is where we can swap back. But I actually want to go back to Bright Falls first. So. We still got the weird lady looking at the puddle for some reason. Let's jump in the car and head back. To Bright Falls. Ellis Lodge. So this is where the actual investigation place is. Alan Wake. Oh, he's still being interrogated. My name comes up, your books come up. You come up. I've read them. There are echoes of my life in there that makes me feel like someone's been <laughs> watching me. Oh no, it's the cultists. What happened at Moisturizer spray is handy. The unanswered mystery. I have a friend who has expected to find you alive. Eczema and it can get quite bad sometimes. And she uses a moisturizer oh, spray instead. That's killing me. Right, we're about to get ambushed by cultists. I think she has a uh, eczema. So it's a uh, skin condition. Makes her skin like dry up and for the die and one. flake off. Shit. That's the one. Coffee. Take it you're not a fan then. Agent Casey. This is not your playground. And I'm not your fucking crazy. Like she gets other stuff that she has to that you can't use for it to stop it getting too bad, but moisturizer helps a lot. Rules hardly apply. It's very complicated to make fiction come true. I saw visions of what's happening. What will happen? Dreams. I try to use them in my writing. I understand how dangerous it is now. Even with a paralyzing amount of planning. I think I stopped writing. I think I gave up. <laughs> but there's a manuscript. Maybe I forgot not to write. The dark place makes you forget. Oh, we're gonna have another dark place section. Or is Casey gonna go? I just want to fix this. Full Find New York detected on these. Is everything. Shut up. Get down. FBI. We want 
the rider. No one else needs to get hurt. Fuck off. Time for him to show his max pain roots. Hey, what are you doing? Here comes Scratch. It's close. Stay down. Wait, I need a gun. No chance. FBI. Ah, Casey, you're a muppet. Masks. What have they done to him? It's Alan Wake time. Scratch is basically like uh I had escaped the dark place, so had the dark presence. Scratch. He was yep. here in Bright Falls. I could feel him as a growing pressure in my head. Stronger by the minute. Why didn't he kill me with the rest? What did he want? So yeah. In the dark place there was a I thing living in there. there. It's messing with us and it decided to make itself look like Alan Wake to mess with him. And it's called Scratch. And it likes making a mess. Granted, it usually does it with nightmares and stuff. It doesn't usually do it in person. We were That's on the same side in this fight. Strength in numbers. Casey, where are you? I need to protect myself. Torch and a shotgun. A gun and flashlight. Let me turn these off before I give away some username again. I hear shadow things. We're taken. That's Casey. He was still alive. Case is a badass. Ow. to Casey instead then. Run. 
Save me, Katie. Ah, I can get the light bit. Batteries, shotgun rounds. Single shotgun round. These were the cultists the FBI were after. Were they letting themselves be taken? Or did the dark presence not discriminate? Get to the safe bit. The pressure in my head was unbearable. Scratch was getting closer, stronger than ever. Oh, you're not allowed in here. This looks more like a legged section then. That's Casey. He was still alive. Let me pass. be taken or did the dark presence not discriminate Stop. you keep moving my head was unbearable scratch was getting closer stronger than ever Casey! eased off. Scratch was further away. I could think again. Casey. Casey, I'm coming! Fuck. Casey, no. Petrua. Uh, the evil Barton stuff is messing with us. How you doing? You working again? Are you on your break? Or are you off today? FBI, drop the knife. Got him. Elmo? Sagi, you don't understand. Is this is the FBC. FBC. Yes. Fine. FBI investigation, the case has been transferred to us. This is bullshit. Noted. We're moving the evidence and paperwork from your field office to our base of operation at the sheriff's station. Any other pieces of evidence with you? Anything relevant? The clicker. I can't trust them with it. Nothing comes to mind. <laughs> Five o'clock okay. Minecraft session. Then your work here You've been done. on one of the, uh, hey. the chaos servers well. again, is it? Or are you just my having a chill session? MIA. We'll look for She's him. my partner, damn it! Agent, be... go home. Careful, the big wing. They think he's a para utilitarian. No. Fuck this. I was so close to getting the clicker to wake. I'm not done here. Not until I find chill world. Nice. Not until my family is safe from this horror. I uh. I got gifted hell divers. And because I was saving up money to buy Helldivers, I instead bought myself Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. So now I have both. It's music time.
or don't know if you saw as well true i've got an interview on thursday it's like an assessment interview thing but it's for a really good company so i'm hoping i get it keeping my fingers crossed and everything I got a, I don't know if you saw the post, but I've uh, got an interview on a Thursday, like an assessment interview for a really good company as well. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Really hoping they get it. Tor and Odin were in the photo with a the clicker. They might know how it works. I'm off the case, but I can still visit family. <laughs> Good. Need it. Right. Time to go and visit Thor and Odin again. This way, innit? Phone call. Hello? Saga! It's Thor, your grandfather. About time you were coming to visit, kiddo. How did you know I was coming to see you? Never mind that. We have bigger problems. We're losing. Oh, fuck! Fuck you, you fucking egg! Fuck! Shit. Something is off at that nursing home. Right. Um, so. Well, that was a manuscript. Saw that just as I pressed the button. History of the Valhalla Nursing Home. The Valhalla Nursing Home, founded in 2014 for Odin and Tor Anderson of the old gods of Asgard fame, for their twilight years. Built after the return comeback tour, flip flop to be their farewell tour, cut short, cancelled. As their agent, Move Barry Richard Wheeler had managed to coax a few hit songs out of them before that. Balance lays the demon, a couple of others. The old men rocked like their namesakes. The backstage parties got out of hand. The air was thick with smoke. Wheeler squinted. His migraine flared, booze and drugs. A rock and roll cliche. They ran off after every gig. Wheeler had security track them down to the craziest after parties. So it's just Thor and Odin being nutters again. Right, case board. What have we got to update? A bunch of them. It's the cults. They're at the Thor nursing home. Thor and Odin might know something about the clicker. With Wake out of reach, this is my best lead. So he was yelling shit before he got cut off. What else have we got? We've got this bit about the, the clicker to wake and close this damn case before my family the magic gets clicker. To further into it. Right. Then we've got Cult of the Tree. Ilmo. Being a dick. And they tried to kill Alan. So we've got story bits, but we can't use those yet. Stash. Got another one all in watery. More nursery rhymes. Oh, God. oh yeah. 
more about the FBC messing with the um, the thing for the different dolls there, yeah. Main doll. Bear doll. Monster doll. Right. It's all them sorted. We'll do a proper game save and then we'll switch on over to Alan. Um, I'll write that one. I will see what Alan's been up to. Switch. We'll switch to Alan making his way out of the darkness again. Oh, we're here. So, Pistoru. And we're trying to make our way out of the studio. It was all about me. This performance the dark place was putting on but I had no control over it I knew how utterly lost I was so yeah this is us inside the dark place phone call the payphone was ringing again the mystery caller was back at it I had to find out more Nope. How the fuck could I? Whoa! There's that famous temper. Lucky thing I'm not a paparazzi. You keep jerking me around, refusing to tell me who you are. You remember? You... Oh, fuck me. Alan, 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 listen, listen. Uh, tell me, how much do you remember? Did you visit Parliament Tower? Did you find anything there? Yeah. Alice is in danger. Scratch is reaching out to her, and there, there's another manuscript. Not initiation, return. I saw the title page. I, I don't remember writing it. Return? Oh, man, this is what we're after. The Scratch can't have it. Our, our survival, the survival of the fucking cosmic everything depends on this. Come to me. Ocean View Hotel. I left my room key for you. It's right there on the payphone. Remember, mm -hmm. the dark place works in lobes and rituals. If the waves keep pushing you away, you just need to find another way in. We go with the flow of this ocean. Catch you soon, brother. Wonder if that's the writer from the first game. The Ocean View Hotel. A suspicious invitation to a shady meeting. Right on the money for the hard-boiled genre the whole city was built upon. Oh yeah, we get a map, don't we? Where is the hotel? Straight ahead. And then there was something over this way. on the other side of the talk show entrance. Yeah. Words of power. Sweet. Words of fix. Maximum health. We'll do that. Sun Milk is officially the first here as well. Congratulations, Sun Milk. You 
usually my sister's the only one who remembers that's there. Ocean view. Oh, that was pretty easy. The Ocean View Hotel. <laughs> my destination. Right. Now this is going to be a puzzle to get my way to his room, isn't it? loop that delivered me back to the street yep what did the mystery caller said if the waves keep pushing you away you just need to find another way in with only dream logic to lead me to the hotel I look to the neon signs for guidance your peak bar was building was fragile constantly under attack there was no time to waste the dark presence was only a step behind me we'll head to the bar and see what that says if we can Light. Casey, Casey. you're the killer, the cult leader. It's in your eyes. No, you've got the wrong man. It's scratch. Ooh. There's no time to lose. You're going nowhere. <laughs> Who got shot? You shoot Alan, did Alan shoot you? Alan shot you. Uh oh. Kind of contest, is it, Trua? Build on what he's left you. Nice. The writer. We were the same. This place kept pushing me under, getting into my head, poisoning me with darkness. Go for it, Trua. I had to find a way to escape before it was too late. Too late again. Oh well, yeah, I get to play with the thingy now, don't I? Right. Check down here first, because there was a friendly arrow. Friendly arrow says that way. More words of power. Do I have this one? like I do. And it pops me out in a loop. There's another word of fix. What do we do with this one? Safe havens. Nah, we'll just 
bomb pop the max. Right. Time for some magic. Yep. Can I get in the bar now? Looks like I can. Chucks me at the top of the bar. Where do we go from here? Oh, is it like a... drop just the right style for you. here first before I change stuff. Up. Uh, zap. And now I have another charge of light I can use. Shadow people. Ah. You piss off. scenery is never good. So you t you timing beneath the between the snares then. Similar when and like I kinda get it because it's how I'd do a bass beat for a song as well. Like if the snare's on three and eight, usually if you're uh doing the stupid thing they call counter bass, you do it on like if it's three and seven you'd do it on two and eight or four and eight. It just depends upon how much of a dick you want to be when you're playing bass. Yeah, 
it can make things very complicated. Especially if the drummer wants to start bringing in party rhythms or something like that. And just makes it even worse. to safety. Right, there's literally nothing in the shoebox. So, we'll heal up a bit. I did pick up a flare though. Didn't notice that. Uh, don't worry about that sun milk, it's one of those things that nowadays genres evolve so fast. Once you get used to one, it's already split off into like two or three others. Yeah. Like there's ways to classify certain beats and things like that, but when it comes to genres, like here one day gone the next. Supplies. Can I hear humming? I see a friendly arrow. in here. Uh. Word of gun. Uh, not consume ammo. We've already got all that. We'll do shotgun. It's a memory thing. streets and alleys, a faded out shadow, glimpsed by some other poor bastard on his way toward the same fate. Your broken dreams become a broken mirror, and the twisted reflection staring back at you with all the pent up anger. Look at the bulge! Isn't it lovely? Oh, oh wow, yeah, you shake those hips, buddy. Hi, Dave. 
How are you doing? I am doing running and hiding stuff. Boom. That's not good. Oh, I thought that was blood for a second. It's not. It's just the Ocean View Hotel. I was getting close. What? I can't see it. Unless. Yeah. Oh, has it been a long one? <laughs> oh, Dave, 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 look what I've got. So, you know, I was saving up to buy Hell Divers and somebody bought it me. What I bought myself instead? It's another memory there. How do ocean views there? If I go this way, See what else changed. Yeah, I've been getting uh, constant updates throughout the day from Ashley. She's loving it. If I go through this now, I come out. Like this. But it's there we need to get to. Sure, you can just jump down there, Alan. Right, there's the entrance to Mara Peak. There's where we come out. At the other end of this. I can grab a light from. Just doing it to trust you, Truer, that's what it is. Ah. 
Lotter's still here. Lotter is still here. By hosting it might be testing you, Truer. Once again, stone locked by a puzzle. Right, so there is a memory up there. Which implies we should be able to get to the right angle to do it. boost stun enemies do the healy one see he's still got light there affected where the door led to. Uh -huh. Got ya. So, if I go... Stairs down. No. Don't light this one. if I put you back. Go 
ocean view where we're trying to get to Take a shotgun for nineteen dollars, please. The bar menu caught my eye. So, how do we change this? Until you see the sunrise, somewhere where the sun still rises, settling down, buying a house, fixing it up, building a life, finding someone. It's a fool's dream. It would all go bad. And having let hope in, it would be unbearably worse than this. Right. No. Bound to be a way to get the shotgun when we just need to find it. I could use that oh. shotgun. Invent ah. Oh. I need to make room. Um, ammo here as well right so pop one of these Due to the quick slots. Um, sugar ammo. Can I pick up more? I should be able to. Yeah, the only thing I couldn't pick up was the heel. the light back. And then take it away again just in case we need it. Like for 
that asshole. Now I can go and pick up that heel. into the hotel. Meet this mysterious person. Key code. Just that about the dark presence. Casey's thing. The plot board was empty again. I needed a new draft. I mean, the mystery caller at Ocean View Hotel. We are looking for. I can't remember what room number. Uh, where can we find a code? Where is going to be a, a likely place for there to be one? I guess it'd be around here, but. Settling down, buying a house, fixing it up, building a life, finding someone. It's a fool's dream. It would all go bad. And having let hope in, it would be unbearably worse than this. You can take the man out of the city, but you can never take the city out of the man. the memory. Where can we find the code? Hi Craig, how are you doing? God, you
switch. Twenty five fifty, right, but that's the code. Tekken. I am good. I have been jump scared once so far. And it wasn't even by Manu or Bart or you. Although I am still getting stun locked by puzzles. There. Although I did do quite a good math puzzle very quickly. <laughs> No, not more jump scares, please. I also have Final Fantasy to play as well now. I have it purchased and downloaded ready. This more sound messing stuff. It is, it's going to be the other writer. Because he was in the... Um, he was in one of those dive suits in the first game. It's probably going to be him. That'd be my guess, anyway. Uh, balcony. I love that shadow effect. It's like real shadows. Power of ray tracing. Yeah, we need more arty. Arty will fix things. He's probably got spare keys to the doors I need to get into as well. <laughs> the room was empty except for the projector. More games. Was the film a message waiting to be played? Technically, Alan has already woken up. This is like... Backstory to how he escaped the darkness. Or it's Alan. What are you doing? Time for a new cutscene. Is it? In this temple of shadow and mist, it is it's saying it's the other writer. And a door in the ceiling. There is no knowing. Am I standing still or running? You're the one who's been calling me. Indeed. I'm Tom Zane. Welcome to the House of Zane. The poet. The diver. You look like me. How the hell? Or maybe you look like me, you handsome devil. The Diver was a beloved character I played in one of my films. I'm a filmmaker, a celebrated auteur. I need answers. Why is Return so important? What, Al? You, you always get worked up like this. Come on, I'll fix you a drink. We're in this together. Two artists collaborating, remember? Crafting the keys to our escape. 
your magnum opus return on its its companion piece, my film. Sharing our our life-altering visions, a, a melding of higher minds. Dreaming up our transcendental work of art. Here, in this room, 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 in this room. They just get wasted. Is how the magic happened. Enough of this bullshit. Alice is in danger. I need another murder site to go further. Back to Parliament Tower. Scratches. Your wife is safe back in the real New York. But Scratch is reaching for her through an overlap. Return is the key to escaping the dark place. You need to get it before that freak does. If there's a murder site here in the hotel. Let the waves of your riding carry you there. <sighs> Hello? That was the doctor from Control. They're all to us. If anyone asks, you were never here. I can't remember his name now. It's the guy who did all the training videos. Tom is saying it ended our talk in what felt like a paranoid fit. I had what I needed from him. There was another murder site in the hotel to guide me further toward my escape. I had to write my way to it. Right, we got another memory thingy. Featuring a murder cult. <laughs> How meta can you get? He said, looking knowingly at the camera. I could sense the cult of the word in this, and their leader, Mr. Scratch. Rumored to be Alan Wake, the writer who'd gone missing years before. The hotel was a perfect setting for a Casey story. I was on the right path. I would start at the entrance lobby. The entrance hall set the mood where everyone had come in. The victim, the murderer, the detective. An idea, clear as a vision, waited for me here. So there's lots of other rooms, including a culty symbol one. Although that's circles instead of triangles. The room at the end of the corridor was closed off. It felt significant. Something terrible would happen there.
More loot. Nice, that one's got the cult symbol on it. It's another memory thing nearby. Where's the thingy for this one? of the cult was cursed from the pre-show ritual on. The cult is an immersive theatrical experience. Uh-huh. You're gonna have to walk me through what that means. Immersive theater. A play where the audience can participate, spread across this hotel. The cult is a legend. The only written copy of the manuscript lost, the play is passed on as oral tradition between theater companies. Each company only performs it once. The play was said to have special power. You were like kids playing with a Ouija board. And when you call for the devil, he will come. The pre-show ritual. That's it. Set it up. Start from the beginning. actually leads to the front entrance. Yeah. So we can get in and out properly now. draft back at the beginning but closer to my goal change how everything is see what we can find This is probably my favourite new mechanic in the new game. Quite literally having puzzle areas where you have to reconfigure the entire room. Layers upon layers. A play about a murder cult infiltrated by a real murder cult. The ballroom was where the pre-show ritual was held. I see what the hell. This is what I was looking for, actually. So. We're going to save and I'm going to go and get food. Because I'm hungry. So. We are making decent progress. We're going to find out what happened in this creepy hotel. And we know that. They used some sort of ritual to get out of the dark place. Although Zane hasn't showed up yet, so... Who knows what happened to him. So we'll find someone to raid, shall we? 
server is online. I know. Megan is doing some overwatch. Just want to say hi to her. Thank you for coming everybody. Thank you for the resub Manu and thank everybody else for hanging out. She shall, shall see you all soon. You can uh, go and annoy Megan while she's playing some Overwatch. Although she is remarkably good at that game so probably won't annoy her much. And I shall see you all soon.